cha cha beat jerry do ah pop pop see you again flex beat got a song flex the verse yeah what are you hey yo what up this is boy flex beat the sweet beat i am the producer behind boy fade and jerry do new banger in the city right now peace of mind and i'm actually here to show you how really they started and just for the record sake i am a hit producer i am a world winning producer i produce a lot of great songs across the country we have which of course i have won a lot of awards on and uh, this is this this is an epic one so I, i really come here to show you how really we started this whole project and uh, how this beat how, how i came out uh, with this beat stay tuned for the next as i come to show you how we really start this beat bit by bit i'm going to show you the breakdown Cheers. Okay, so welcome back. Um, this is the whole, this is the entire beat of a uh, piece of mine, and uh, and this is the vocals. These are the vocal lines. These are the vocals, but uh, this is the whole mix down of how how I did the beat. First, uh, what really came to my mind was a melody was a little melody and uh, I use uh, I, these are plugins I use I use purity I use uh, span uh, mini 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 purity and span that was the two key um, plugins I really use here from the from the lines of the keyboard so this this is a span and this is uh, purity for the clarity sake so in uh, impurity I came right here to the guitar line and I use a mute guitar, a disc mute guitar to give me a melody that I really want. So the first melody that I ever played was was this was this. So that was the that was the exact melody that was the exact melody I really wanted, and you know. I wanted for me to to get it. I as soon as as I get this and the all the ingredients start to follow. So this this was the main source of the song, the main vibe of the song. That was the whole main vibe. So for the clarity, this this FS to twenty point seven. Uh, that's why I use so. When I when I get this, I I decide I say okay, let me lay the drum lines. Then from there, the other ingredients will follow. So the first drum line I ever laid was this, was the was the snare. So it was just a normal normal clap, normal 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 clap that we uh, as an afro. As an Afro beat, uh, the normal clap. So I love to blend and make my kick, my clap more, more, more spicy. So I add this clap. So, but but this time it came in in a half beat with like like up and down. The the starting is low and the the middle part, the 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 harsh part is high. So it, it was just coming in, pumping in, coming in. So. Yeah, just like that. So, uh, the next thing I added here was a was the agogo. Yeah, you get it. To make it to make it those passes that that when it kick hit it, so you can hit more harder, so you can hear the the real real original sound. So I added another one there to spice up. Got all my things. I love to blend it. So I add more than two or three to make it sound more real and original. So yeah. So I added the kick. The kick I used here was um the call this the the beat the beat way kick. Yeah, it got it's really strong. It's really that that much strong. So. Uh, that's what I really use and hmm, it sounds more nice. Let's let listen to that. Mm. 
mostly mostly I love mostly I love do my kick and eh? I love do my kick. I love I love the wing the wing kicks. So, but on this beat, I actually did. But let, let me see what what next I already are here. Uh, added something, a tom, yes, a tom, a tom to give me more vibe. It's simple and uh, so cool, like yeah, you can feel the vibe. Then the next thing I added here was the next thing I added here was a rim, a rim like. So when it, when the rim, anytime this rim, anytime this rim hit the kick, you will be you you're gonna hear the sound like yeah, it's gonna sound more heavier and yeah, more spicy. Yeah, so let let add a kick to this rim, and you're gonna hear uh, the the. The experience I'm talking about. So you're gonna hear your your kick now. We're gonna be sounding more more vibrant and more more relaxed. Yeah. So let's add the snore. Then I use a shaker here. I use this shaker. Yeah, there's a normal shaker we we do so I, I have to I have to arrange it. You see you're shaking chick 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 Yeah so that are that are most of the things that we've uh, added here so you can hear the original one. song which is the guitar line the guitar line which i really want to play which is the main vibe of the whole song the this this is how it sounds so um th this this was the main line i really wanted and i needed something to to find vibe like yeah for the vibe to be more extra so what what i did i played a keyboard line and this is from purity this is from uh purity and the chord is is within the purity on the on the on, on the piano line on the piano pre preset so i used that preset called mellow mellow ep to give me this vibe still satisfied i said let me yeah let, let me still bring a, another vibe 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 there to to boost it up so i i look for another keyboard line to vamp it up more and this one this one uh, uh, is fun okay it's fun and it's called it's called plus 13 champagne right to the power line you can get it at the part where you see um all this part there's a part here okay from the action part you can get that when you check within this Presets you're gonna find it. Uh, it's called the sham part. So I try to use this part to give me a, re a real life fine vibe being like this. Yeah, you hear that? It's just a fine, a fine beat. So if you if you hear all the other vibe that I play for for the first time, you know that uh, uh, um, you're gonna experience that you you hear this. So actually, that was it. So we we keep adding some more vibe. Okay, I keep adding some more vibe. Keep adding some more vibe. And the next thing I ever added was the was the was the bass line. Was the bass line and uh, the, the bass line is very special. I use an 808. Yeah, 808 bass line to to give me this this bass line. So there's there's an there's an there's an 808, but the way I use it, I I play with I play with them, or use a lot of playing playing out here, so it sound more more extra. That that was really.
20A and uh, that was the hard. I used two 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 base uh, two extra base lines in this the the the, the main one and the and the vibe one that one was to fight and this one was the was the straight lines to to boost it up when the when the chorus dry and then a the piece of mine is a so I mix the song I mix it in the way that uh, every segment of it has it own has a special bass line that, that will come and correspond with that. Yeah, I, I will be getting that play. Yeah, so the transgression I ever made and uh, it already it was already set in and, and kind of nice. Then the, the next thing I ever added here was the um, was this. I uh, from from a span uh, a, a the coil a digilot a digilot plus twenty two a digilot so and uh, it is a sound that you will always hear within the song. That vibe that you will hear that vibe within the song and it's always in the song like anywhere maybe the chorus drive or anywhere where the emotional part is coming the the vibe is coming you always hear that there and uh, that was one of the greatest thing i ever had and one thing i ever hired that is always not beat when you really listen to it and when you put a headphone on you're gonna hear something like this yeah, that, that one is just giving me that feelings like uh, that the, the way the kick is going and everything is going. Yeah, it gave that spice and that feelings for you to feel. Okay, and it was good. And one thing I ever used was so whenever you hear um, I didn't, I did not piece of mine. Then I did not got it done. So, so you're gonna hear that the, the another transgression like uh, another vibe. Yeah, another special vibe like this. Yeah, so that another nice vibe that like, like, like you could hear that will make make you wake up again. So okay, this song has come to another yeah another floor. So so far so good. That was all that I played here along with my with the promo and other stuff like that, and it was all nice. So all together, can we just listen to it together so that we can get the vibe? So we can enjoy the vibe together. So um. I want to take another time to come to the vocals, how I mix the vocals and other stuff like that. But I just want to tell you how this beat was done, how everything was done. Yeah, you always hear this, this really in the beat, and uh, <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Then my promo. This beat, I'm not, we're not really thinking about Pink's Peace of Mind at all. No, 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 never. But what really came uh, up to my, what came up to my mind when we were just sitting and played the beat, and he said, Flash, I can do something crazy on this shit. I said, Like, really? Like, he had done a couple of songs, yeah, he had done a couple of songs, which of course he's been thinking, but this one is very, it touched me, and he started to come up with that vibe, like, uh, Peace of Mind, Peace of Mind. Uh, peace, of, peace of Mind, we did it first. On another fight, and he said, Okay, I can change the fight to another fight. And I was like, Yeah, I think it can work. And he started to do something and it started to correspond. And like, 
I will start myself like you start giving me some more inspiration to add more more vibe like the way you were coming on it and everything was cool cool I said okay that's good that's nice before then he told me okay I think Jairo can get on the song and after then few few weeks later we sent it to Jairo and Jairo like fuck with him you know it took no time he hit the studio and we killed the shit and it was it's a mad 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 hit right now so I want to tell everybody thank you for uh, uh, the support tell everybody thank you for um, always listen to our sound I just want to give you the breakdown of how we did the, the beat here and uh, keep following subscribe to my channel and one love let's be we're always here you know.